Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be kind of an updated makeup collection storage type video. Um, which is mainly what you see in the background of all of my videos. Um, I did film one of these um, quite a few months ago now. I will link that in the description box down below. Um, but I have since got quite a bit more makeup and also my storage is different and um, I'm also in a different room now. So my whole setup is kind of different. So yeah, that's what this video is going to be. Now, um, for the this video because it's going to be quite long i think i'm going to split it into parts i'm not quite sure yet how many parts it's going to be in um but i will see how long it's going to take to film and i might cut it up into parts um just to make it a bit shorter and um yeah so if you want to see my makeup collection and storage then just keep on watching. Okay, so excuse the lighting. It is obviously, well not obviously, but it is nighttime right now. It's dark outside, so I have to use artificial lighting. It's crappy, but it's what we deal with. Um, so basically, this is my whole setup. So obviously here, these are my drawers, which is my main makeup storage. Um, we'll get to that. Um, then we have um, this desk, which is from Kmart. The lights are from Kmart, but I'm not sure if they sell. I don't think they sell them. I'm not quite sure if they have them online, but I got this on Boxing Day sale, which is the only time I ever saw them in Kmart. So, um, if they are online, I will link them down below, but it is just a Hollywood style mirror with like a touch, um, button to turn the lights on and off. Um, here we have palettes, um, some brushes and um, some pictures. Um, here on this side we have more brushes, a little mirror which I don't use anymore now that I have the big one. Um, some bits and bobs, uh, Google Home moisturizer. Um, I have this full length um, mirror with a box. I, uh, Peter Alexander box which my best friend so kindly so kindly sent me a gift um, and then I guess this is a part of it more pictures down here um, a few canvases that me and my best friend painted when she came up from Queensland and a little candle all right so that's a quick overview oh underneath we have a bin um, a little storage uh, box thing some journals notebooks and a James Charles brush set so, yes, that is the whole overview of my um, makeup area. Um, the chairs from Kmart, it's just got a towel and a jacket over it, but it is just a white spinny chair. So, yes, that is the overview of my makeup storage and uh, collection. Okay, so I guess we'll start with what's over on this um, side of my storage desk whatever um so yeah as i said i have this mirror that i don't really use um this little um container is actually i think a toothbrush holder from kmart um brushes all different types of brushes um i think that's from a magazine bys um lots of morphe that's just from wish um morphe morphe and all of these little brushes here um, are from Morphe. There's a, um, I don't know what brush set this is from. Jaclyn Hill maybe? No, I'm not sure. But then all of the other ones are the back handles are from the James Charles um, collection. This mug is my absolute favorite mug. It is so cute. Um, and an eyelash curler. Um, I have my Google Home sitting on like a coaster. Um, I have this Burt's Bees um, Hydrating Gel Cream, which I got the other day and I've used it twice, I think. So I don't really know if it's good yet. Um, 
I'm sorry if the lighting's not the best. I probably shouldn't have filmed this um, at night time, but you know. Um, so then here I have a little Blistex, which is almost run out. This little Clinique Moisture Surge, which you can tell is almost all gone. I love it, but it's $50, so I'm not buying a new one. Um, little Q-tips just to fix uh, mascara and stuff. Some bobby pins in this cute little tin. Um, a candle. A little koala figurine. Um, and this um, Neutrogena moisturizer. So that's what's on that side of my desk. And then I have um, a pair of blue lens light glasses. Um, and this, um, these are all of my beauty sponges in this little tin which I got from Kmart. It was 50 cents on like clearance. Um, so I have a Real Techniques one. I have a few Kmart ones. I think, yeah, these are both Kmart ones. Morphe, Flower. Um, this one is from Emco Beauty. Um, so is this one. Um, I think this one's Kmart. And I'm not quite sure where this one is from. I can't remember. It was in a Bella box anyway. And then this little cheap one. So, yeah, they are all of my beauty sponges. I just put them in there. It's kind of overflowing, but it's the best place I have them right now. Then I have this Witch Hazel Toner, which I use every morning and night. Love it. So, yeah, this corner is mainly my eyeshadow palettes and more brushes. So, here I have this little Jolique, um Rose Water Balancing Mist. I don't really use this. It doesn't want to focus on it. Yeah, I don't really use this, but it's cute. <laughs> and then I have this, what brand is this called? Is it Holy Moly, Roly Poly, Moly Toly? <laughs> I don't know the brand, but it's just a peach hand cream. So then I have more brushes here. I have some Nude by Nature ones in this style brush. There's a few um, highlighter brushes, which I don't prefer these anymore. Um, some Morphe ones and I've got a few pens and stuff in this one mainly pens actually because um, they're handy to have on the desk and I have two uh, pair of tweezers um, I got this little tub from actually an op shop and then that pink one at the back is from Kmart and this little mug here is from Typo which I love Okay, so moving on to my palettes. I have the James Charles palette, which this is just the box. This is the actual palette. Um, I have a Morphe one here. Um, and Morphe X Jeffree Star. Um, I have this Revolution one. Um, uh, Zoeva Tarte. This one is... Um, Go to Beauty or Copycat Beauty, the Danielle Brigoli one, and so is this one. It's a highlighting palette. Um, I have two of the Morphe X Jaclyn Hill ones up here, and I have the Zoella Brunch Date palette here. So, oh, and this is just eczema cream because you know. Okay, so on the top of my drawers, I have two succulents, they are real. Um, and they've actually grown a lot. Um, I have this Natio Rose Water uh, Drench Mineral Face Mist. I don't use this much. Um, I don't know why. I just don't. <laughs> um, this Kat Von D Perfume. This is in Saint. And I got this um, Versace Perfume as well. Um, the Avengers Marvel Sephora Collab palette which I don't like um it's not the best but I do like the packaging um I got happy Cam Von D Cat Von D um Alchemist Holographic palette um the Jeffree Star Liquid Frost in Ice Queen um I have this little cute Peter Alexander card that my best friend sent me so I've, it's just sitting there um, a Yankee Candle in the scent Stony Cove. It smells amazing. And of course, my Conspiracy Palette sitting on the top. So, yeah, that is everything that's up the top here. It's quite cluttered, but 
um, it doesn't look too bad um, it's fine you know it's fine we deal with it okay so I'm going to start in the um, top drawer don't mind the shaky camera I will be putting it on a tripod after this top drawer um, so in the top drawer is kind of uh, some makeup removers um, and wipes and stuff so kind of like the go-to drawer so I have all of my wipes are from Kmart so um, they came up branded so I have the rose hip and jojoba oil shea butter cleansing wipes which I had to get them ones because these ones were sold out when I went in um, so I have obviously these ones these are super good um, love them that's why I have lots of them um, I have a few of these cotton pads which I keep the rest of them in my wardrobe I just put a few in here at a time <laughs> I have these KFC like wipes just because you know I had them and they could come in handy obviously not for your face um, more like fingers and stuff so oh dropped a few of them um, I have this Natio Acne Clear Spots Purifying Spot Treatment which I'm not quite sure if it works I only used it a few times and kind of forgot about it um, and I just never think to grab it so um yeah have that um, a wet hair brush which is really good I love it um, a face razor this is an Emco Beauty one um, yeah I've used it a few times it is quite good it doesn't break me out which is good um, a hair tie um, a screw not sure where that's from but it's in there um, I have the Sephora waterproof eye makeup remover a little mini which where did I get this I think I got this in a oh yeah like a Sephora favorites bag um, online um, this little niacinamide brightening toner which I used a few times I got it as like a, a free sample thing in an online package that I made one time can't remember off what website but you know <laughs> um, I got this simple eye makeup remover um, I don't really use eye makeup remover much um, I have the Maybelline New York Eye Lip um, Eye and Lip Makeup Remover. Um, I have a fan, <laughs> which my nan got from overseas somewhere. It's super pretty. Um, I have this Alpha Liquid Gold um, One Use Facial Pad, which I got as a free gift in a Sephora order. Um, and another full pack of these wipes and then this little bioderma solution micellar water and that's it for the first drawer okay so this is my lips drawer I hope that angle is okay all right We'll make do with this so basically up the back I have my um like actual lipsticks and a few uh, matte liquid lips in the front here I have my lip glosses and a few lip liners mainly lip glosses um, a few more mattes here um, lip balms up the back so let's jump right into it this is one of my bigger drawers um, one of my more full drawers so yeah let's just jump right in so for my lip liners, I don't have too many purely because I don't really use them that much. Um, but I have these ones which um, I'm not quite sure where they're from. My auntie gave them to me. Um, I think they're off like a cheap website, maybe. I'm not sure. I remember she had heaps of them. You weren't even looking. They weren't even in the frame. <laughs> um, I remember she had heaps of these um, and asked if I wanted any, so... I grabbed these ones this was a while ago I can't even tell you how long ago this was but um, yeah so not quite sure where they are from but nevertheless I have them I have this mellow one in the shade Aria um, but yeah I don't really use lip liners that often at all um, and then I have the three Zoella X Colourpop ones as well um, I have the Emco Beauty um, what's it called? 2-in-1 Lip Treatment High Shine Gloss in Berry. 
Um, I got that not that long ago. I have the I Heart Revolution um, unicorn type one. Okay, I think this is a better angle. So I have the OXX Cosmetics um, just clear gloss. I have a, another Revolution um, gloss. I went through a big buying gloss phase apparently. Um, the Essence Shine Wet Look Lip Gloss. That smells amazing. Um, the Floss Gloss. Um, my new favourite lip gloss um, in LHR. This smells amazing. Um, it smells like custard. <laughs> Um, I have the MK Beauty Just Clear Gloss, which I love. Um, I have this Ginger and Lime Lip Balm, which is meant to be all natural, and it is all natural, but my lips don't like it, so there's that. Um, a lot of these things are from Bella Boxes, I believe. This is from um, a Bella Box. It is a tint stick, so it's like a, a marker. Um, yeah, don't really use that. It's very pink. Um, this is from a Bella Box as well, this Quince and Crimson Lip Crayon. I really don't use that at all. I don't use a lot of these, to be honest. I don't think I've ever used this. This is a Thin Lizzy Velvet Lip Cream. Um, yeah, haven't used it. So you click the button at the end and it comes out the top. I should probably use that. It looks like it'd be a nice colour. Um, then I have this little thing which came with my Laneige, um, sleeping mask. I have the Zoella Beauty Watermelon Lip Oil, which my, my lips don't really like that either. Um, the Go-To Beauty Lip Gloss. That is very pale, so don't really wear it. The L'Oreal uh, Cream. Um, BYS Lip Plumper Hydration Volume. I got a Chi Chi Lip Lights um, lip gloss, which it looks like it's not very wearable, but from what I remember, it's quite wearable. So, love that. Um, a Hailey Baldwin um, Model Co. lip gloss. I love this. It smells like strawberry chopper chops. Um, I have this matte lipstick that mum bought from Vietnam. Um, I think it's a Vietnamese brand. I'm not sure, but I've never used it. Um, I have this Ultra 3 Lip Glaze Tinted Oil, which I absolutely love this thing. Um, if you see one of these in, I think this is from a Terry White Chemist. You can probably, you can get it probably anywhere where they sell Ultra 3. But um, I just love this over the top of some lip balm. It looks really nice and natural. Um, there's another one of them lip liners. Um, this is just off of Wish, I think. It's just a, a lipstick. Um, yeah, not a fan. <laughs> I could probably do a declutter, to be honest. Um, so then I have this model pref Models Prefer, I don't know what this is. It was like 50 cents. I got it online. Um, where did I get it from? Chemist Warehouse, maybe? Um, and it was like 50 cents on clearance. So I was like, yeah, why not? <laughs> um, I got this Color Live, um, Steve Laurent Beauty, very pink. I, I don't know what it is, a lip tint, a lip gloss apparently. Um, I got that from a Bella Box. Um, and then I have this MK Beauty Rose Lip Balm. Um, yeah, my, my lips don't love this, but it smells really good. <laughs> Alright, I've changed directions because I kept bumping the camera and it's probably very annoying. Um, so I have this, um, actually I have all three of these Zoella Colourpop um, matte liquid lips, which is where all of the lip liners come from, came from because I got them in the duo thing thingy. Um, I have three Jeffree Star lip products here. So, um... All of these came in mystery boxes. So I have the bullet in Jeffrey's Girl, which is very pink. Um, and then I have Can't Relate and a question mark shade. So, yeah. And I don't really use them. I don't use lip products much, which is surprising when you see how many freaking lip products I have. Alright, so moving on to the one at the back. 
Um, this is more of my lipsticks and matte lipsticks. Um, so I have the NYX Liquid Suede Lipstick, which is very, very pink. Um, I have the NOXX um, Matte Lipstick, very red. Um, Luna by Luna Matte Lipstick. A Wet n Wild Lipstick in What's Up Doc, which is very vibrant and it's not even been opened. That was from a Bella Box. This was one of my very first ever lipsticks. It's in the brand. What brand is it? Colour by TBN. <laughs> um, I have the Colour by TBN, another lipstick. The Style London um, lipstick. Very nice shade, actually. That was from a Bella Box as well. I love the packaging on that. Um, I have a Revlon... Ultra HD matte lip colour in it's purple, so probably never ever gonna wear that to be honest. Um, I have a few, a couple of these CoverGirl jumbo gloss balms. Um, this is just from Wish. This, um, what is it? It says it's a lip gloss, but I'm pretty sure it's a matte lipstick and it feels very dry. <laughs> um, I have this NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream, which I love this. It's like one of my favourite lip products that I have. Highly recommend um, this product. It smells amazing too. Um, I have this So Susan Cosmetics Liquid Matte Lipstick, which I got from a Bella Box. Um, this is a red matte lipstick from Wish. I have a Tarte Matte Lipstick, Kat Von D Matte Lipstick. Um, My Beauty, this is obviously from Maya, this is a bullet lipstick, which is actually a nice shade. Um, BYS Velvet Lips, this smells disgusting, it smells like, like straight oil, I don't know why, maybe it's off. <laughs> um, I have this Huda Beauty um, Liquid Matte Lipstick, um, a Go To Beauty, which is the Copycat Beauty uh, Lipstick, two of these NYX High Voltage Lipsticks. Um, a Kmart lipstick, KM lipstick, and a Pixie um, lip balm. Okay, so that is all of like my um, lipsticks and lip glosses. And then up the back here, you can see there are all different types of lip balms. Um, so I have the Laneige sleeping mask, um, and then I have I can't grab it. <laughs> Um, the Elizabeth Arden Intensive Lip Repair Balm. And then just heaps of different types like Blistex, um, Natio, Cocoa Butter. I love this one, the Revlon Coconut one. Um, and yeah, just a few different lip balms up there. Um, this Cocoa Butter Palmer's one, my lips do not like that um, at all. So... Yeah, I have a few of them because I got a three pack and can't use them. <laughs> so that is everything in the lips um, drawer.